Hello everyone and welcome back to Elden Ring. So I was looking around on the map just to see if there's things that I haven't done yet. Um, and one of the things that I noticed is Yura. Wasn't he the guy, isn't he the person who Shabriri's, you know, possessed? Isn't that the case? And if it is, why is he in two locations? So, we're just going to take a quick look at that and see if I am in fact crazy. Cool. Well, we got a katana. Ferociously long blade. Oh. There's your washing pole, guys. There it is. It does exist. Not that it's much longer than the hand of millennia, but... Compared to the short katanas, it's quite long. So that was one thing I noticed that I was confused about. Um, I've also decided we're going to just go kill this guy. I'm tired of his little red dot being on my map. So that's the plan. So many wolves. Oh my goodness. Will it ever end? Get a little bit of a PvP sort of fix here. That's fun. Good to know players can get knocked down out of that with a great sword. Ooh, we got armor. The scaled set. Okay. Um I feel like there's something else in Limgrave that I don't remember. I remember the Ailing Village. Was it this pond? Or was it the tower? I think it was the tower. Ah, he sold the Zweihander. Oh, he sells a lantern as well. It's 
get ourselves 2,000 more souls and buy that other stone sword key. Probably should buy that lost Ash of War. don't remember the tower over here. We may have gone to it, but I'm just in the mood to clean up things on the map. Like, I know that there's more dragons in the dragon borrow. Sir. I feel like I have been here. Isn't there a trap chest at the top of this? Am I remembering right? Back before I knew what they did and I just didn't let it take me? There is. Okay. So we'll see where this takes me and then we'll head on over to the Dragon Borrow. I remember being disappointed in this, but someone made the comment that I'm misunderstanding the purpose of trap chests. They're just one-way warp gates. Haven't I been here? So it's through this over here first. I actually have not been here. This is a grace set. Okay. This is a new grace. Let's head into the capital and see where it drops me off. And while we're at it, yeah, scaled armor doesn't look half bad. I need you not to be on top of that. That's better. Just noticed that those are actually Giza wheels that are tied to its that are on its arms. Stormhawk axe.
Oh, you're a little more aggressive. I didn't expect that something in Limgrave would take us all the way to the capital. Pretty neat. That's pretty neat indeed. Well, let's uh, head over here to the other side of the Divine Bridge Grace. Does that sound familiar? The other day I, in between playthroughs, just literally sat here reading all of the key items. And the Divine Bridge sounds familiar for some reason. I don't remember why. You're gonna come alive, aren't you, friend? Side, yep. Blessed Dew Talisman. Slowly restores health. I wonder if you can spam it on and off to rapidly increase your health. That was a thing for a while with a similar ring in one of the games. And we have a warp. Interesting. This was a bridge at one point, it looks like. Where did it connect to? Looks like it connected over here. Interesting. We have a sending gate this way. Does the direction the sending gate faces have any indication on where it sends you? Also... Okay, I know where that is. Got it.
saw that enemy across the way. This is the tower. This is a tower. Are you kidding me? No. No. Is that where I read the, the... Is that where I read about the gate? Or the... Not the gate, but the bridge? Beyond the Lost Great Bridge. Well then. This is why you clean up the map once in a while. After we finish with this, I know there are more dragons in the Dragon Barrow area. So we're gonna go dragon slaying after this, you know, and it's what a knight does. We'll have to dress the part. Should upgrade a great bow for the sake of it. <laughs> Just to honor the best honor the best giant in any of the Souls games. EG is pretty chill though. I, I won't agree. I won't disagree. But Goff hunts dragons. We can see that from here. Okay, that can wait. Imagine coming here and not having found whatever this place is. And then you just see that and you're like, what am I looking at and where is it? That's really freaking cool. Way to tease an area. Bravo. Alright, what do we have here? The blessing of this half-rotted rune reduces the healing power of flasks, yet due to the infusion of Millennia's spirit of resistance, attacks made immediately after receiving damage will partially recover health. Oh, it's it's Bloodborne. This, this, this one lets you play Bloodborne. Neat. I mean... We put on that. What's well, another bloodborne weapon we can put on? We don't have any guns, so we can't put on a gun. So. I mean. Rocking dual katanas is kind of a bloodborne thing. One big, one small. From, uh... Oh, shoot. Come on, brain. Work on it. Remember it. Think, think, think. It's the transformation of... The weapon that you get... That Maria uses. It's not the Chikage, but the... Rakuyo? I think... It's, it's been a while since Bloodborne. I'm going to lock in the answer as Rakuyo. We put quick step on on the first katana or bloodhound step. <laughs> I 
I mean... Okay, I'd like to be able to actually warp. All right, Limgrave, let's head to go. Let's just go here. Ha, enemy. Playing Bloodborne now, guys. That's pretty cool, I'm not gonna lie. Looks like you can't get any after the fact. What I mean by that is after they've died, you can't uh, overheal. Oh look, an item we missed. That's enough of that for now. Happy we did it, though. Very satisfying. Oh, this one's already keen. Interesting. I didn't even notice. Oh, did I do that when I put Bloodhound step on? 
Never mind. <laughs> uh, silly me. Let's head back over here. Go see uh, if anything's changed now that Grank has left. Everything's the same. All right, well, let's go hunt some dragons. I have to say, that's quite a lot of, uh, vulgar militia. Okay, there's an upper and a lower bridge I never noticed. Is that a grace? Or is that some other kind of shiny? That's a grace. I've been here. It's the rise. Ah, okay. Oh, you know where I also haven't been? Um, the Tower of Kaled. Yeah, there's stuff going on around the base of it. What? love abusing those iframes. Who 
found something new. This is why you do what we do. This is why clearing the map is a good thing. We we'll use that as a reminder we have to go there, but we're going to continue along our path. That said, this is where we're going to end things, actually. I hope you enjoyed this one. Thank you for stopping by. I'll see you all next time.